yes today we are going to discuss very very important topic in permutation and combinations that is permutations permutation with repetition permutation with repetition that is chapter is over what is that is permutations permutations or permutation with repetition permutation with repetition chapter ne what permutations with repetition in the previous section in the previous video we have learned about in the previous video video or in the previous section we have learned about permutations the number of permutations the number of permutations of n different digits n different digits taken r at a time taken r at a time when the repetition is not allowed when the repetition is not allowed clearly in npr already we discuss but here we discuss in this chapter we have to discuss that is permutations with repetitions permutations with with repetitions permutations with repetitions is nothing but using number or using the digit or using word again we use we have this permutations with repetitions permutations with repetitions here the number of the number of permutations the number of permutations of n distinct things and dissimilar things n different things the number of permutations of n different n different things taken r at a time taken r at a time taken r at a time the things the things can be can be repeated repeated any number of times the things can be repeated any number of time is nothing but repetition is allowed repetition is allowed what is the formula how to calculate if the repetition is allowed how to calculate the number of permutations of n dissimilar things taken r at a time when the repetition is allowed let us discuss one theorem here that is theorem if n and r n and r are two positive n and r are two positive integers n and r are two positive integers then the if repetition is allowed if the repetition is if if the repetition is if the repetition is Hello. If the repetition is hello, then the number of then the number of permutations, then the number of permutations, then the number of permutations of n dissimilar things of n dissimilar things. n dissimilar things taken taken r at a time taken r at a time is is n power what is the formula n power r clearly n power if n and r are two positive integers if n and r are two positive integers if the repetition is allowed if the repetition is allowed then the number of permutations then the number of permutations of n dissimilar things taken r at a time n dissimilar things dissimilar things that means different things n dissimilar things taken r at a time is is always n power if the repetition is allowed already already in previous session we discussed the number of permutations of n different things taken r at a time when the repetition is not allowed repetition is not allowed then the formula is npr npr but here there is the number of permutations of n different things taken r at a time then the 
the number of permutations of n different things taken or at a time. When the reputation is allowed, reputation is allowed. That means using digit or using the number already we use again. That means that means reputation is allowed. Reputation is allowed. Then the number of permutations. How to calculate that number of permutations is we have a formula that is n power n power r. Yes, proof. Proof here. Already we know that. We know that the number of permutations of the number of permutations of number of permutations of n is n is similar things or n is different things. N different things taken taken.
Similarly, every blankness, every blankness, how many ways to fill this every blankness means M ways up to R blankness also. We have how many ways to fill this R blankness means R blankness also. How many ways to fill this R blankness means clearly M ways. Y means, Y means we use the reputation is allowed. Reputation is allowed means using digits or using thing or using object again we use. Reputation is allowed. So every blank place that is first blank place how many ways to fill this first blank place means clearly M place. How many ways to fill this second blank place means nearly also this is also M place. Why because reputation is allowed. How many ways to fill this third blank place clearly this is also M place. How many ways to fill this fourth blank and so on, how many ways to fill this half black place means half black place also we have n ways. By using fundamental principles of counting, by using fundamental principles of counting, total number of ways are total number of permutations. Total number of permutations of n distant things, n different things, different things. Taken, taken R at a time, taken R at a time, taken R at a time. Reputation is allowed. Reputation is allowed. R A means what? R A means reputation is allowed. Is clearly that is N by using the fundamental principles of counting. N N N N N N N. How many ways? N ways. So that is N into N into N into N so on into N. How many times? Clearly, R times we have R blank places, so R times. This can be written as N into N into N into N into N into up to R times. That can be written as N power R. N power R. So, observe here, if N and R, N and R are positive integers, if N and R are positive integers, if the reputation is allowed, if the reputation is allowed, then the number of permutations, then the number of permutations of n different things or n different objects taken r at a time, taken r at a time is clearly n power r. n power r. The number of permutations of n different things, the number of permutations of n different things taken r at a time, when the reputation is allowed, is how much? n power r. Let us discuss one small example here. Yes. Here we discuss one small example. That is, find the number of permutations of find the one example that is find the number of permutations of four digit number four digit numbers that can be formed by that can be formed by using the digits using the digits using the digits 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 when reputation is and the reputation is Observe here this example. Find the number of permutations. Find the number of permutations of four digit numbers. Four digit numbers. Find the number of permutations of four digit numbers. Number of ways. Arrange the four digit number. Four digit numbers. That can be formed by the using the digits 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. How many ways? 1, 2, 3, 4. Using the digits 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So when reputation is allowed, we want number of permutations. We want number of permutations. Already we discussed the theorem. By theorem, solution of the here. By theorem. By above theorem. Clearly, n different objects. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Here, n is equal to how much? 6. We have n different objects. Up to here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. n different objects. We want four digit numbers. So R is equal to how much? 
clear the R is equal to 4. We want 4 digit number. That means 4 blank places. We have 4 blank places. And R we have N distinct things, that is 6 distinct things. So N is equal to 4 in the R. Therefore, required permutations. Required number of permutations. Required number of permutations is equal to. Already we know that n power. What is the formula? n power. n power. Clearly that is equal to 6 power 4. 6 power 4. n power r. That is n value 6. r value 4. So 6 power 4. So 6 power 4 means 6 square is 36. So 36 into 36 into 36. Clearly 6 is 80. 6 is 18. Sorry, 6 is 36. How much? 6 is 36. 6 3 is 18. 18 plus 3, 21. So 2 1 6. 3 6 is 18. 1 3 3 is 9. Clear. Okay. So 6 9 2 1. How many is it? 1 2 9. Total number of permutations is equal to how much? 1 2 9. Ah, uh, this is the formula. How to calculate by using fundamental principles of counting is by using fundamental principles of counting after here. Given digits are uh, 1. Given digits, this is 1 to 9, 6. Clearly by using formula, n power r. By using fundamental principles of counting, given digits 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So, n is equal to here, here, 6. We want four digit, four digit numbers. That means we have four blank places. We have one, two, three, four. Four blank places. How many ways to fill this first blank place? How many ways to fill this first blank place? Means clearly we have one, two, three, four, five, six, six digits. That means n different objects. Six different objects. First blank place. How many ways to fill this first blank place? Means we have to write one, R two, R three, R four, R five, R six. How many ways? We have six ways. Six ways. How many ways? Six ways. How many ways to fill this second blank place? This is first, this is second, this is fourth. How many ways to fill this second blank place? Means if one is here fixed, again we use one. Why? Because here repetition is allowed. Reputation is allowed. Reputation is allowed. Ah, yeah. Reputation is allowed. That means using digit. Again we use. If 2 is fixed here, or 6 is fixed here, again we use 6. No problem. Why? Because reputation is allowed. So how many ways to fill this? How many chances? How many ways to fill this? Second blank versus means. Again we have 6 left. 6 left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Why? Because reputation is allowed means we use it digit also again we use it. So here also we have that is six ways. We have here also six ways. How many ways to fill this top blank place means reputation is allowed. So using digit if you fix here two, if you fix here four, again we use three and four. So how many ways to fill this top blank place means here also we have Clearly six ways. How many ways to fill this fourth blank place? Fourth blank place also. How many ways means clearly that is six ways. We want four digit numbers. So all four digit numbers by using a fundamental principles of counting. By using a fundamental principles of counting. So number of required permutations is equal to number of permutations. Our required permutations is equal to 6 into 6 into 6 into 6. Number of required permutations is equal to how much? 6 into 6 into 6 into 6. Clearly, that is 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, power 4. That is equal to how many ways? 1, 2, 9, 6. This is the answer. So, we learn the formula that is n and r are positive integers. n and r are positive integers. n and r are positive integers. If the reputation is allowed, if the reputation is allowed, then the number of permutations of n different objects, then the number of permutations of n, dis n dissimilar things are different objects, 
taken R at a time is really N power R. What is the formula? N power R. If reputation is not allowed, reputation is not allowed. In this previous section, we already learned about reputation is not allowed. Then the number of permutations is equal to N P R. Now reputation is R N A. Reputation is not allowed. Then the number of permutations to calculate number of permutations is equal to how much? N P R. N P R. If the reputation is not allowed, N P R. If the reputation is allowed, what is the formula? N power R. Number of number of permutations of N different things. Number of permutations of N different things. Take like an R and then when the reputation is allowed, when the reputation is allowed, we have this chapter permutation, permutation with reputation, permutation with the reputation. So number of Permutations of n different things taken R at a time. If reputation is allowed, it is clearly n power R. N power. Observe the second example. That is, find the number of four-letter words. Find the number of four-letter words. We want four-letter words. Find the number of four-letter words that can be formed by using the letters that can be formed by using the letters of the word. That can be found by the using the letters of the word piston, P I S T O N, piston, in which at least in which at least one letter is repeated, in which at least one letter is repeated, at least one letter is repeated. So in this type of problems, how to calculate it? At least one letter, one letter, at least one letter is repeated means we have the formula that is. The number of the number of permutations, the number of permutations of n different things of n different n different n different things. The number of permutations of n different things taken taken or at a time. Taken R at a time. Taken R at a time. When the when or when with with at least one digit. The number of permutations of any different things taken R at a time. At with at least one. Letter is repeated. Or one thing is repeated. Or one thing is repeated. One thing is is repeated. One thing is repeated. So what is the formula? Is it possible? N power R minus N P R. The number of the number of permutations of N dissimilar things taken R. The number of permutations of n dissimilar things taken R and n with at least with at least one thing is repeated. With at least one thing is repeated clear the formula. Important is n power r minus n power r minus n p r n power r minus n p r n power r minus. The number of permutations of n different things or n different objects or n dissimilar things taken R and n. With at least with at least one digit is one thing is repeated. Formula n power r minus n p r n power r minus very very important formula that is n power r minus n p r. That means n power r means here repetition of things. Repetition of things how many how many ways means n power r. n p r is nothing but number of permutations of n dissimilar things taken all at time. Repetition is not allowed. Is I N P R. So if you do it, then for N P R minus N P R, we have a number of permutations of N P R minus N P R. At least one thing is repeated. At least one thing is repeated. Answer is solution. Find the number of four letter words. We want four letter words. Can be formed using the letters of the word piston. Given that. Here P I S T O N piston. So N is equal to how many? One, two, three, four, five, six, six. 
six different objects is there. So I am using for six. We want to fold in four. We want to find the number of four letter words. We want to find the number of four letter words. So R is equal to how much? R is equal to R is equal to four. So number of required permutations is equal to number of required permutations is equal to number of required permutations is equal to. Clearly, we know that. The number of ways, the number of ways, or the number of permutations of n can be similar things like in R and in M. When the permutation is allowed, means how much? Six power four. When the permutation is allowed, means six power four. Or subtract four power is n power r minus n p r. N power r minus n p r is the power. What is the value of n here? Clearly, six power four minus six p. Six power four minus When we use the formula means, when we use this formula means, at least, at least one letter is repeated. At least one letter is repeated means the total words. If the repetition is zero, total number of ways is n power r. N p r is nothing but total number of ways arranging the four letter words with the repetition is not allowed. With repetition is not allowed. If you subtract If you subtract the number, the replacement is not allowed. From the replacement is zero. We get the at least, at least one letter is repeated. That is n power r minus n p r. N power r minus n p r. So we have six power four minus six p four. Six power four is nothing but six six thirty six thirty six six sir. Two one six two one six six into six. That is one two nine six nine. Six cube is how much? Six six thirty six thirty six six. Yeah, two one six six two six. We are using six six thirty six. Six one is six plus nine six six is equal to how many? How much? How much? One two nine six. And we want six p four value. Six p four. Six p four is nothing but six five two m by six minus four five two m. That means six five two m by two five two m. Six five two m by two five two m. That is equal to Two factorial into three into four into five into six by two factorial two factorial two factorial get cancelled. Three four twelve twelve five is a sixty. Sixty six is how much? Three sixty. Clear. Six factorial by two factorial is how much? Minus three sixty. That is equal to one two nine six minus three sixty six minus zero clear is six. Nine minus six three. Twelve minus three. Twelve minus three clear is. Nine thousand, nine thousand. So observe here the number of the number of find the number of four letter words. Find the number of four letter words that can be formed by the using the letters of the word piston, 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 or piston, in which at least at least one letter is repeated. How to calculate in which at least one letter is repeated means we have a formula that is the number of permutations of n. The number of permutations of n different things taken r at a time, taken r at a time with at least one digit is repeated. With at least one thing is repeated is nothing but n power r. N power r is nothing but repetition is allowed. That means repetition of total arrangements, total permutations with repetition is allowed means n power r. N power r minus n p r is nothing but n p r means the number of Number of arrangements. Are the number of permutations of n similar things taken R and M when the repetition is not allowed? If you subtract this one, n PR from n power R, we get the we get the at least one thing is repeated. The number of permutations of the number of permutations of n different object taken R and M with with at least one thing is repeated. With at least One thing is repeated here is n power r minus n p r. n power r minus n p r. So we use this concept here. Six power four minus six p four. Six power four is nothing but four ninety six. Four hundred ninety six minus six p four is nothing but three sixty. If you subtract four hundred ninety six minus three sixty, we get nine hundred thirty six permutations or nine hundred thirty six arrangements. Have at least one thing is repeated. At least one thing is. 
नेक्स्ट नेक्स्ट पैलिंड्रोम्स पैलिंड्रोम्स स्टडीज पैलिंड्रोम्स स्टडीज ए नंबर आर ए रो ए नंबर ए नंबर आर ए वर्ड which reads a number or a word which reads same which reads same a number or a word a number or a word which reads same either either from left to left to right from left to right or from right to left from right to left a number or a word a number or a word which reads same which reads same either from left to right either from left to right or from right to left is called is called is called palindromes is called a palindrome a number of the here palindromes means a number a number or a word a number or a word which reads same which reads same either either from left to right either from left to right or right to left either from left to right or right to left is called a palindromes is called a palindromes number or a word anything number or a word which reads same which reads same from left to right from left to right or from right to left is called a palindromes is called a palindromes example observe here example that is e y e is a palindrome word observe here left to right e y e right to left e y e a number or a word let us take second example 121 a number or a word which reads same it reads same from left to right left to right e y e i from right to left e y e i same which reads same from left to right or right to left then the words From left to right, also here left to right, one twenty one. Right to left, also one twenty. So a number or a word, a number or a word which reads same. A number or a word which reads same, which reads same from left to right, from left to right, or right right to left, from left to right, or right to from right to left. Is called what? Palindromes. Is called what? So example, I E Y E I is a palindrome. 121 is a palindrome. R O T O R rotor. So R O T O R rotor is a palindrome. Palindrome number 1 2 3 2 one is a palindrome number 1 2 3. Other here from left to right 1 2 3 2 one. Right to left also 1 2 3 2 one. So these are called what? Palindrome numbers. Palindrome numbers. We have the formula to calculate the palindrome numbers means that is no the number of the number of palindromes the number of palindromes with odd distinct ends odd distinct odd different odd different letters. Are different letters or words? Are different letters that can be formed by that can be formed by that can be formed by using that can be formed by using n different letters, n different or distinct. 
n different letters the number of triangles how to calculate the number of triangles the number of triangles with the r r different letters with the r different r different different r different letters that can be found by using that can be found by using n different letters is is first one first one that is clearly n power first one n power r by n power r by 2 when when r is when r is even when r is second one n power r plus 1 by 2 when when r is observe here parallel means of parallel means a number are a word a number are a word a number are a word which reads same which reads same from left to right or right to left from left to right or from right to left is called palindrome is called what palindrome so e y e is the e y e i e y e i is the palindrome 121 is the palindrome number e y e is the palindrome the word palindrome word one root of r o t r root of is a palindrome word 1 2 3 2 1 is a palindrome number so how do you calculate the number of palindrome numbers with the r different things then how to calculate how to calculate number of palindromes number of palindromes with the r different different letters with r different letters by using by take by using n different objects other is n different things is other is n different letters is depend on r value depend on r value here is n power r by 2 n power r by 2 when r is even the formula is n power r by 2 we want the palindromes the number of palindromes means n power here repetition is allowed using the digit also we use so what is the formula n power r by 2 when r is even if r is odd when r is odd r is odd that is n power r plus 1 by 2 n power r plus 1 by 2 is the number of palindromes to find the number of palindromes how to find the number of palindrome words or letters words are the words are the number words are a number or a word which reads same either from left to right or from right to left is called palindrome so how do you calculate the number of number of numbers palindrome numbers by you with the r distinct things and given n different things as n different numbers means we use this can be depend on the clearly r r value r value if r is even the number of palindromes is equal to n power r by 2 n power r by 2 if r is odd then the number of palindromes is equal to n power r plus 1 by 2 let us discuss small example yes observe this example find the number of find the number of find the number of 6 first problem 6 7 7 second problem 7 6 7 letter palindromes 6 letter palindromes that can be formed using the letters 6 letter palindrome or 7 letter palindrome that can be used in the letters of the word equation that the letter letters of the word equation observe here first we want 6 letter palindrome solution we want 6 letter First one, six letter palindrome. Six letter palindromes we want. So R is equal to clearly six clearly. How much? R is equal to clearly six. R is equal to six. By using the word, given word is given word that is E Q U A P I O L P equation. So n different letters that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. n is equal to how much? n is equal to 
How to calculate the number of palindromes means the number of palindromes depends on the R value. Depends on the R value. So here R is equal to 6. Clearly this is what? Evenness. R is equal to 6. Clearly this is even. Therefore number of palindromes is equal to number of palindromes is equal to. If R is equal to even, R is equal to even, what is the formula? N power R by 2. If R is even, R is even. If R is even, the number of palindromes is equal to N power R by 2. Clearly, so N value here, 8, 8 power 6 by 2. That is equal to 8 power 6 by 2 is nothing but 8 power 3. 8 power 3, clearly 5 power. So, the number of palindromes, the number of palindromes is equal to how much? 5 power. We have six letter palindromes. Six letter palindromes is how many words? How many palindromes? Next, here also the second question that is seven letter palindromes. Seven letter, seven letters palindrome. Seven letter palindromes. Where the R is zero, how much? R is zero. By using the letter of the letters of the word equation, so we have equation and different words that is what? Letter that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, nearly n is equal to. Number of palindromes is equal to number of palindromes is equal to. How to calculate number of palindromes means so this is depend on the clearly R value. Here R is equal to how much? Nearly R. R is equal to R. So number of palindromes is equal to n power r plus 1 by 2. Then r is r. R is r. Then r, r is r. Number of palindromes. Number of palindromes. How to calculate the number of palindromes is equal to n power r plus 1 by 2. So that is equal to n value of 8 power r value 7 plus 1 by 2. That is equal to 8 power 7 plus 1. 8 by 2. That is equal to 8 power. 8 by 2 is nothing but 8 power 4. What is the value of 8 power 4 is nothing but 4048. 4048 is the 8 power 4. That is 4048. So, this is the example to calculate the number of palindromes. Number of, how to calculate the number of palindromes means by depend on, depending on the R value. If R is even, then number of palindromes equals n power r by 2. If r is r, number of palindromes is equals n power r plus 1 by n power r plus 1 by 2. That's next. Yes. Next one. That is one more. That is no. Important formula. The total number of the total number of The total number of permutations, if the total number of permutations of n different things, the total number of permutations of n different things, n different things, the total number of permutations of n different things taken, taken not, not more than not more than R at a time. Not more than R at a time. Not more than R at a time. When, when each thing may be repeated, then each thing may be repeated any number of times. Any number of times is is n into n power r minus one by n minus n into n power r n into n power r n into n power r minus one by that is n minus 
ఇది అబ్జర్వ్ చేయండి ద టోటల్ నెంబర్ ఆఫ్ పర్మిటేషన్స్ ఆఫ్ ద టోటల్ నెంబర్ ఆఫ్ పర్మిటేషన్స్ ఆఫ్ ద టోటల్ నెంబర్ ఆఫ్ పర్మిటేషన్స్ ఆఫ్ ఎన్ డిఫరెంట్ థింగ్స్ ఎన్ డిస్టింక్ట్ ఆబ్జెక్ట్స్ టేకెన్ నాట్ మోర్ దాన్ ఆర్ అట్ టైమ్ టేకెన్ నాట్ మోర్ దాన్ ఆర్ అట్ టైమ్ సో టోటల్ నెంబర్ ఆఫ్ పర్మిటేషన్స్ ఇస్ హౌ మచ్ ఎన్ ఇంటూ ఎన్ పవర్ ఆఫ్ మైనస్ ఎన్ ఇంటూ ఎన్ పవర్ ఆఫ్ మైనస్ వన్ బై ఎన్ ద టోటల్ నెంబర్ ఆఫ్ పర్మిటేషన్స్ ఆఫ్ n different objects or n different things taken not more than r at a time not more than r at a time is n into n power r minus 1 by n minus r n minus 1 so we need to prove observe here we have n different things we have n different things but we want but we want taken not more than r things at a time not more than not more than taken r at a time that means if you take one at a time two at a time three at a time four at a time five at a time up to r at a time r at a time we want the total number of permutations we want total number of permutations first place first place can be filled in can be filled filled in n less first place that is one at a time one at a time means we want the sum of the the number of the total number of the permutations of n different things taken not more not not taken more than one at a time not taken not taken not more than r at a time not not more than r at a time means first if you take one at a time number of number of ways fill the blank is n is taken two at a time taken or right here taken one at a time right here taken taken one at a time taken one at a time is equal to n is n is taken two at a time taken two at a time clearly n squared minus two at a time is two boxes so first one is n second one is also n right why because here repetition is allowed so repeated any number of times so first box is also filled with n and second box also filled with n so n squared minus next taken three at a time taken three at a time is equal to n cube taken four at a time four at a time is equal to n power four ways and so on taken n at a time sorry r at a time taken r at a time taken r at a time is clearly n power r why because the repetition is here therefore total number of required permutations is equal to therefore total number of required permutations therefore total number of required permutations is equal to we have it that is n plus n square plus n cube plus n power 4 plus n so on up to n power up to n power observe here clearly this is very very important theorem that is the total number of permutations of n different objects the total number of permutations of n different object taken not more than r things at a time not more than not more than things not more than r things at a time is clearly if you believe in which the very repeated any number of times is clearly n into n power r minus 1 by n minus n into n power r minus 1 by n minus 1 so if you take we want if n is equal to 7 r is equal to 5 what is the total number of permutations total number of permutations taken not more than 5 at a time means taken 1 at a time 2 at a time 3 at a time 4 at a time 5 at a time so not more than r at a time means taken 1 at a time how many ways to fill this blank means one blank means n less taken 2 at a time how many ways to fill this two blank means first blank and 
M base and second value blank also M base. So we have replaced this alone, that's why N into N we get L square. Taken three at a time. That means if you take three boxes, first box N base, second box N base, third box also N base. So N into N into N, N into N. Taken four at a time. N into N into N into N, that is N power 4 base. And so on, taken R at a time. Taken R at a time is nothing but we already know that N power R base. N power R base. We want total number of permutations. Total number of permutations is really N plus, N square plus, N cube plus, N power 4 plus, and so on. N power R. Observe here, clearly it is in a ZD. Clearly it is a ZD. It is a Geometric progression, here it is a ZP geometric progression. A is equal to how much? First term A is equal to N. Common ratio, common ratio R is equal to Clearly T2 by T1 that is N star by N, we get N. Common ratio is also N. So always what? Common ratio. What is the sum of, sum of N terms in ZP? Sum of N terms in geometric progression. SM is equal to A into R to the power N minus 1 by A into R to the power N minus 1 by R minus 1. R minus 1 is the sum of, sum of first N terms, sum of first N terms of geometry progression. SM is equal to A into R power N minus 1 by R minus 1. So here also we have it in GP, N, N square, N cube, N power 4, N cube by N square, we get N only, N power 4 by N cube, we get N only. So T2 by T1, T2 by T3, T3 by T2, T4 by T3, we get N, 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 N. So common ratio, that, that uh, ratio of any two constant terms is always constant. So clearly it is in CP. So we want SM. Therefore, total number of permutations is equal to total number of permutations is equal to permutations is equal to A into here, 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 here. R power, R value how much? R value how much is N only? N into. How many terms is there? Up to N power R means R terms. R boxes. Not more than R at a time. So, how many terms? How many boxes we have? R boxes. So, N is equal to how much? N is equal to R. So, such a figure. N power R minus 1 by E. R minus one is n but n minus. N minus very very important thing. So this is n into n power r minus one by n minus one. Observe here the number of the number of total number of permutations of n different objects. The total number of permutations of n different objects taken not more than r things at a time. Taken not more than r things at a time. Not more than r things. Taken not more than is the formula to calculate the number of permutations is n into n power r minus 1 by n minus 1. n into n power r minus 1 by n minus 1. So here, let us discuss one example, small example. Example that is, what is the sum of all the two digit numbers or find the find the Sum of all two digit numbers. Find the sum of all two digit numbers that can be formed by that can be formed by using the digits using the digits one two. Observe here one example. Find the sum of all two digit numbers. Find the sum of all two digit numbers that can be formed by using the digits 1, 2, 3. Here clearly, here clearly, we want the sum of all the two digit numbers. Sum of all the two digit numbers that can be formed by using the digits 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Observe here. So Find the sum of all two digit 
numbers that can be formed by the that can be formed by using the digits one two three. Here clearly, last previous topic that is the repetition is not allowed. Here repetition is not allowed. Repetition is not allowed. R and M is what? Repetition is not allowed. Repetition is not allowed. But we want sum of all the two digit numbers. How to find the sum is observe here. First of all, write the general process. After that, let us discuss some formula. So, what is the general process means? Given digits, observe here. Given digits, is it for how much? One, two, one, two. Observe here. We want two digit numbers. Number of two digit numbers is equal to. Or number of permutations. Or number of arrangement. Number of permutations. Number of permutations. Taken two at a time. Taken two at a time. Clearly three p two. Three factorial by three minus two factorial. Clear. Clearly how much six. So what there are per number of permutations. There are there are clearly. If you take one two that is one two and one two one three one two one three two one two three two one two three and three one three one two three four five six this is this is this is these are the two digit number that can be found by the using the digits one we want the sum the sum we want the sum here the one plus thirteen plus twenty one plus twenty three plus thirty one plus thirty two we want observe twelve plus thirteen clearly twenty five twenty five plus twenty one forty six forty six plus twenty three sixty six plus three that is sixty nine sixty nine plus sixty nine plus thirty sixty nine plus thirty one clearly hundred hundred plus thirty two how much This is the concept. Find the sum of all two-digit numbers. Find the sum of all the two-digit number that can be formed by the using the digits one, two, three. Clearly, repetition is not allowed. Repetition is not allowed. How to find the sum? Means this is process. One, two, plus. This is number sum. How many arrangements? Means one, two, three, four, five, six, six arrangements. We want the sum. Clearly, this is. So how to calculate if the number of the if the sum of all five digit numbers five digit numbers that can be formed by the using the digits one two three four five six seven eight nine ten means by writing all the two digit numbers or five digit number by using a one two three four five six seven eight nine ten the digits clearly it is difficult to calculate the the sum. So what is the formula? To calculate, to calculate the sum of the, the sum of the all digit number, the sum of the all digit numbers that can be found by the using using the different n different things, n different things, the sum of all all digit numbers that can be found by the using the n different things means we have a formula that is observed. 